Thousands of people paying tribute to a professional bull rider who lost his life following a competition in Denver yesterday. 25-year-old Mason Lowe competing at the National Western Stock Show in Denver. He suffered a fatal injury after getting bucked off the bull that he was riding. News 5's Katie Blaze joins us live from the Denver Coliseum where a tribute was held for him tonight. Katie. Well, so much love in the arena tonight for Mason Lowe. The overarching theme that he was so much more than just a bull rider and the legacy he left behind will never be forgotten. It is with extremely heavy hearts that we share with you. We have lost truly one of our own. It was just 24 hours ago when Mason Lowe was bucked off the bull he was riding, pulled under and was struck by the bull in his chest. The injury fatal. A talented young bull rider gave his life doing what he loved. We lost Mason Lowe. On Wednesday night, thousands of people coming together at the Denver Coliseum to pay tribute. Mason will be remembered for his infectious smile his relentless determination as a competitor and his willingness to help anyone at any time. He was a loving husband and a caring friend. And in the end, Mason was exactly what he loved and exactly what he wanted to be. Mason Lowe was a cowboy. If you knew him, the last thing that man would want was to bring the party down. With that, Lowe's fellow bull riders entered the arena to honor their fallen brother. Ladies and gentlemen, I promise you right now, the bull riders you'll watch tonight, they're not riding to win this event. They're riding to honor Mason Lowe. Lowe was ranked 18th in the world. He is survived by his wife. Now there is a fundraising site set up to help Lowe's family. And if you'd like to donate to that, you can find more information on our website at koaa.com. Always watching out for you, Southern Colorado. Katie Blaze, News 5.